Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to give you an update on UFO Gaming. We're going to look at what they have going on fundamentally and then get into the charts. So they did just announce a closed beta program that's going to launch on April 8th. So if that's something you want to participate in, I just wanted to bring that to your attention. You can go to their Marketplace website and apply for the closed beta campaign. I will say that when you click on the apply link, it's just a Google Doc, which isn't the most professional way to do something like this. But if you want to participate, that's how you do it. So they have that going on. I did notice too that when I was on the Marketplace site, I haven't talked about this in any of my videos, but if you're not aware, you can stake your UFO tokens to earn plasma points, which can be used in the game. Now, personally, I'm not staking anything. Uh, if you look at the staking page right now, the APR shows 0%. I don't know if that's accurate, but obviously it doesn't seem like it's worth it if you're not getting that much of a return on your staking. So I just wanted to point that out. Over to the charts, I was looking back at different trading view ideas that I posted about UFO gaming, and I posted this one back in November of 2023 and it's always fun going into these if you've never looked at trading view ideas basically traders can post charts and then you can hit the play button to see did what they post or, or what they predict actually play out so like here i drew this five wave pattern and if i hit play here it'll show like has it actually followed what i thought it was going to do so i'll hit play here and so obviously it, it's never going to follow lines perfectly, but it did essentially do what I was thinking it would do where it hit this level of resistance. I actually hit that perfectly. So I had wave one would hit this level of resistance. I should have had these lines as, as red instead of green. And this is green now that I look at this, <laughs> but anyways, it hit this level of resistance and then came back down to this level of support. And as long as we stay above this level of support, then I still think that this is totally in play here to proceed to our next wave up to wave three, potential pullback down to here, and then wave five near its previous all time high. So I know UFO gaming hasn't been super exciting if you've been just watching it from a price perspective, but I'm still bullish on it. I still hold all my UFO gaming, so this is the key level to watch. As long as we stay above this level, then I have no issues with UFO gaming. So I'll continue to keep an eye on it and post either here on YouTube or on Twitter where things are at from a technical analysis perspective. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you in the next one.